Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Mr. Arkansas on this Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Season 1, Episode 14 called River of Time for Legends of Tomorrow. So we start off with, upon the revelation that the robot, I'm not going to say its name because I cannot say its name at all. And we find out that it's technology from the distant future proving Savage has manipulated time. So Rip believes the Time Masters will finally ratify his mission and they set course for the vanishing point, which is where, I guess, time doesn't move, I guess. And that's where they all, the, all the Time Masters are. So Jax fixes the damaged time drive, but is exposed to time radiation, which ages him prematurely. So then Stein is forced to send him back to 2016 to the, um, in the jump ship to reverse the process. So basically... The entire season, Stein has been really selfish. Of uh, first, you know, he drug Jax to get him on the ship, and just made them go on the, all these adventures and that he didn't really want to do. So he's for once thinking not about himself, but thinking of him, and shot him back to 2016. So that way, uh, he it will reverse everything, and that he's actually thinking of him and not thinking thinking of himself, which is definitely a, an improvement. And we, you see that through the entire um, season that Stein is more or less not thinking about himself and has less of an ego and is more compassionate and more of a team player. So anyway, we cut to Carter, who is now uh, named the most whack-ass name ever, Siphon Torville, is kept prisoner while Kendra tries to restore his memories, causing a rift between her and Ray, which effectively uh, um, ends the relationship, which is not a shocker, because we learned in previous episodes that when um, they're in the Wild West, the old woman of her past self said, like, it's not going to end good. Just saying. Then we cut to where Savage tries to, tries to manipulate some of the team members, allowing him to escape his cell. And then, just as Savage is about to kill Kendra, Carter re regains his memories as Carter and saves her. But is stabbed by Savage again, for Kendra knocks the latter unconscious. So then the team runs at the mansion point, where the Time Masters reveal that they have been working with Savage who will be sent back to 2166 to carry on this plan while Rip and his team were put under arrest. Call her me shot. I mean, think about it. They sent a um, Kronos. They kept blocking him. All the other Time Masters are against him. I wonder why. <sighs> that they're so against him going after Savage. Duh. So anyway, um, but I think overall this was a pretty good episode. I, they were also were working on, on trying to turn Cassandra over, which I feel like they did. That's how they got him in the cell. Ugh, this see that's why that's why I wish I had my notes. I'm literally reading this off of Wikipedia because I can't find my notes, and I'm not rewatching it. Again. Ugh. So anyway, because I watched it at least four times. Okay, so basically, what they did was they they uh, took Cassandra, made her a better person, and understood why they're doing what they're doing, because Savage is a crazy person, and they proved, they had proof of evidence of him being a crazy person, to being out of control, and releasing the virus, and turns out his, her mother died from the virus in the first place. So that's how they lured him to get in a trap from the little thought the, that episode of the previous episode. So in this episode, they were all trying to get him and do everything. But with the Time Masters, they said, uh-uh, he, we're working with him. You were returning back to his regular time and y'all are under arrest. Just saying. And then, let's see... I can't remember if there was anything else in this episode that I remember. I don't think so. So anyway, that's what it for this episode. Um, I would give this a... 
I'll give this a B plus. It was actually a pretty good episode. Except for the big reveal, which was not even really a reveal. It's like, what kind of duh? I mean, pfft. like, even his mentor tried to go after him. I mean, what is that saying? I mean, obviously. So anyway, that's going to do for this video. If you like this video, please go to like. Comment down below. Tell me what you think of the episode. Do you agree? Disagree? And if you have any other suggestions for any other TV shows, music, or movies, also let me know down below. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, everybody.